Wilson. McCaw gets it straight away. Now, can they hold them up this time? Doesn't look like it. McCaw again. Just short. And close. No, he wants to have a look upstairs. Well, Sam Whitlock would like the whistle. He did everything but award the try. <laughs> he certainly put some pressure on. Sean, is it a try, yes or no? Sean Feldsman to yes have a look. No, yeah. Para once more. Sibivatu is looking for a little bit of space. He might have found it. Yes, he has. And through goes Stanley. They have got that score. James is back on the pitch, but the referee wants to check for the possibility of an obstruction there. Check if there's interference, to be pleased. And Stanley doesn't the, look so sure. Certainly all the Saracens players, they went straight to Nigel Owens, looking for a crossing. So obvious, OK? I don't think that's crossing. I mean, Farrell has actually taken a line to pick the man out. He's not fading the cross. It's in front of him, but they're certainly milked by Hayo okay, so Farrell. There's no doubt yes, about I... that. Uh, Sam White has gone in front of the ball carrier and he has taken out potentially 10 from the defence. It's going to be a penalty angle. for crossing. No try, no okay? Try. Yes, agreed. Thank you. It's going to be cancelled out. No try. Number seven in front. Yeah, it's a penalty against six if you don't get the try. No, I don't think it. It's Elliot with the ball there. It's I'm Honick. not sure that's what stopped it. I reckon Hang on. Honick has come in there. So you, wa you watch Evans six there. And there's Honick there. I'm interested in talking to you guys. And he twists and pulls, and I think his legs go underneath. He can't so. give that marsh, he can't see it. No. Sean Treby, great play. Oh, I swear they trained this. Treby just dived. Anywhere he could get into the way of the referee's line of sight. That's up. And then stood there smiling at him. Yeah, that's held, that's held up. Great play, Highlanders. It was a good line-out drive, but I think, I think they've done decision. a great job. Yeah, sure. I cannot see a grounding, so I'll go back for the penalty against Sixth Okay, cool. No try. So the try just allowed. Great play from... Let me have a look. His problem is he's not tried to wrap any arms. Yes, he has. He's got to make sure he comes down a lot. I, I, I don't think he can do anything about that, James Lowe. Well, he's really low, isn't he? And he's, he's crouched. Tiki toe lifts, and it's just that whole fork thing, isn't it? 11? 11? No, I can't agree with well, that. Well, have to ask And 15 wide. Entre el número 6, James Haskell, y el número 15, Mike Brown, pues sí, parece que hay pase adelantado de Haskell sobre Brown. Una pena, pero otra vez que los ingleses han estropeado una, una situación en la que todo era favorable para ellos. Y Mike Brown empezando a, a ser el que era, un jugador atacante que, que encontraba fácil el camino entre las defensas contrarias. Ahí el balón de Haskell hacia adelante para Mike Brown. Ben Skin, el neozelandés, es el juez de vídeo y es el que tendrá que orientar a su colegiado Gomen Poat, el francés, sobre esta jugada. Roman, the broadcaster, has confirmed those are all the angles. Ok, I have a decision anyway. From my point of view, it's clearly a forward pass. The ball goes forward. I agree with you, Roman. Okay, no try. Scrum, 42 meters, uh, 8 meters.